Pirates of the Caribbean, number four on Stranger Tides, man. Now, a lot of y'all have been telling us in the comments, four and five are the really bad ones. Like, the first three are great. It's like a trilogy, and they're fantastic, right? Which I, I loved them. She loved them. But four and five, I've heard a lot of bad stuff about. However, I do want to give them a chance. You know what I mean? I will say I've not seen anything from four. I have seen bits and pieces of five. But I have not seen anything from 4. She's seen all of them. Like we said in the other one. She's seen all of them. So she knows what to expect going into it. I don't. But I'm willing to give it a chance, man. I like the series. I like the character. I like the world. So, I mean, I can't hate the movie too much. You know what I mean? I feel like I, I feel like it's not going to ruin the first ones. But regardless, do, do you remember what you thought about this movie when you first seen it? Do you remember what it's about or anything? I don't really remember what's going to happen in it at all. I just remember how I didn't like it because they weren't in it, um, like Will and a lot of people. Yeah, I, there was a lot of new people in it too. I think that's the only part I didn't want, didn't like, because I wanted them to be in there. So mm -hmm. we'll see. So it's kind of, it's almost like they're starting like a completely new storyline, but keeping. I'm assuming Jack Sparrow has to be in it. But regardless, guys, I want to give it a chance. I don't think it's going to ruin the first trilogy for me. So if you guys are watching this, you guys are giving it a chance. You can give your thoughts on this movie in the comment section down below. Because a couple people were saying it was actually pretty good. But regardless, guys, I'm going to stop wasting time. We're going to go ahead. We're going to hop into this movie before we do what we do. I said, if you guys are new to the channel, you do hit that subscribe button. Comment down below what you guys want to see next minute. Comment down below what you guys want to see next, man. Drop a like on the video for us. Full reaction is up on Patreon as well as early access. If you guys want to check that out, link in the description down below. But guys, we're going to go ahead. We're going to hop into this movie. Oh. Fuck. <laughs> it scared me. Ponce de Leon died 200 years ago. Aye, but he died searching for something, didn't he? The fountain of youth. How soon can you say it? With the tide. These new characters look so, so different. <laughs> Probably because the setting changed, because it said they're in Spain now, so. Uh, I don't know. Don't feel weird without Will in it. Did you see that? Toys of pirates being hung. And Pyroman, Captain Jack Sparrow. I told you, the name's Gibbs, Joshua Me Gibbs. Now, what do we have here? That's Jack. Oh my Joshua Gibbs. The crime of which you've been found guilty of. Is being innocent of being Jack Sparrow. Order that you be imprisoned for the remainder of your miserable, moribund mutton chop life. How did he sneak in to be a judge? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I like his intro in the other movies more. I don't remember any of these videos. I've paid off the driver. Ten minutes, we'll be outside London Town Horses waiting. Then it's just a matter of finding a ship. A ship he still didn't have the black. Oh yeah, he didn't have the black exactly. pearl. Barbosa took it. I arrived to hear a rumor. Jack Sparrow's in London with a ship and looking for a crew. I'm not, but that's what I heard. The fact is, you're signing up men tonight. A pub called the Captain's Daughter. There is another Jack Sparrow out there selling my good name. An imposter. Last I heard, you were hell bent to find the fountain of youth. His hair looks so different, huh? I was thinking that. Uh oh. He got finesse, bro. The Spanish have located the fountain of youth. I will not have some melancholy Spanish monarch, a Catholic, gain eternal life. Afternoon, son. Why he looks so old? <laughs> the scene scenery is just so different than what it what it normally is, you know what I mean? Gibbs? Uh, Jackie. Yeah, the world's just changed so much. You've stolen me, and I'm here to take myself back. 
I think it's a woman. That's what I was going to say. It looks like a girl. I was going to say maybe it's Elizabeth if I didn't know she was in this movie. Wasn't in this movie. Pretty sure that is a girl. And they move the same too, like... Literally, like, identical. Only one person alive knows that move. It is a girl. Always wanted to do that. You were the only pirate I thought I would pass for. That is not a compliment. Don't worry, Jack. I forgave you a long time ago. For what? For leaving you. But you're not in fact hold a candle to. I am Captain Jack Sparrow. <laughs> He's gotta be my favorite character overall. Dude's just charismatic. Somebody put him to sleep. Mermaid, Jack. You fool! I had just enough time to study those infernal circles. Every route, every destination, all safe. In here. Well, shit. At least he ain't getting hung. I like Gibbs. He's a good side character. Where am I? Excuse me, Captain Sparrow, sir. I'll be right on it to welcome you aboard our world renowned vessel of infamy, Queen Ed's Revenge. Blackbeard. Blackbeard? I've heard of Homeboy before. I've never Dang. seen him. That looks That's dope. Huge. Black Pearl ain't got shit on that. <laughs> I wonder if Blackbeard's like another Davy Jones, kind of. Or if he's just an actual person. He will listen to me. He listens to no one. Maybe to his own daughter. Long lost. Recently found. Who loves her dear papa with all her soul. He bought that? I sold that. She lied to him and said that she's his daughter? What the fuck? Perhaps she'd be so kind as to provide us an headache. He looks a little bit better now, without the wig. Good news, gentlemen. This is not Blackbeard's ship. This is not the Queen Anne's Revenge. No, no, this be the Queen Anne's Revenge right enough. How do you know? I've seen the name on the back of the ship. Oh! He zombified them, didn't he? He probably can't kill them. I like how in these movies, each ship has something different, you know? Like, these dudes are zombified. Davy Jones was like, barnacles and shit. First one was like skeletons. The ship is ours. Oh shit, Blackbeard really is there. Fuck. Imagine it's his dad. That'd be crazy, huh? What if it is? I think it is. Oh, it's not. I thought it was. Sailors abandoned their posts without orders, without leave. Okay. Mutineers. Oh, he has like powers. I at first I was like, how the fuck are the ropes moving? Oh, you didn't know it was him. No, that's why I was so confused. This dude probably more OP than Davy Jones, to be honest, because Davy Jones really ain't have no powers other than his ship and the Kraken. Give that man a chance. Give yourself. What the fuck, bro? What the fuck is this ship? Again! A voodoo doll. Beloved daughter, the one true good thing I've done in this life, mm -hmm. and you claim to be the one who corrupted her. Uh oh. Neither mm. will you. Oh my god, bro. Voodoo dolls are scary as fuck. Imagine if they were real. I did not notice any fear in the eyes of the Spanish as they passed us by. Are we not King's men? I want to see how he lost his leg. I know he said defending the Black Pearl, but like. Yeah, I want to know what happened too. Like, like, who was he defending it from? Other pirates or? The Black Pearl in the bottle? Why is the Black Pearl in the bottle? The monkey! I'm dead. Jack! I'm dead. Oh my god, fuck him up! Damn! Oh 
Young as fuck, bro. Bro, you know they're a demon. Like they be looking like that, but the second they get underwater, oh look, they tip this shit over. Oh my god, what the fuck? <laughs> it's like a giant fish tank. Mm -hmm. Ladies, they're not even loaded. <laughs> 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 yes, now you will survive. You will walk. What the fuck? So she goes back to a human form when she's not in the water? You. No. You. I was here first. Back, back, we have to balance it out. Slide. I love these scenes with Jack and uh, Barbosa. This movie and the last. Damn, Rocks. they're gone. The Spanish. Oh. They're ahead of us, mate. I forgot about the Spanish. They haven't been mentioned in a minute. Mermaids. Damn. Oh, the little print. What am I doing? <laughs> Did they really kill him? They really killed him? I thought he was gonna be one of the main, one of the big characters. Your sword smells funny. I poison from the innards of poisonous toads. Just a scratch, you dead man in minutes. What did they cut? Oh, oh they cut like his okay, they cut his chest and put him to sleep. That's here. Fuck, they were just sitting there waiting? Shit. Damn. They finessed him. You weren't there that night. Well, the pearl was lost. Taken. Not lost. No provocation or warning or offer of parley. We were peppered with cannon fire. And then the sea beneath the pearl began to roil. Tangling the crew, wrapping around them like steak. And wrap it around my leg. Blackbeard. But my arms were free and my sword was stand. I am the master of my ship, not Blackbeard. Damn, so Blackbeard was the one who took the ship now. That's how he has it in the bottle. Crazy. Mm -hmm. Aqua. De Vida. That was it. <laughs> Dude just got eaten. By the authority granted me by his majesty the king, and with a goodly amount of personal satisfaction, I hereby place you in the custody of the court and declare you to be my prisoner. He's got that poison on his sword, though, so anybody he stabs with that shit is dead. Oh. Get off me. Uh, first I was like, where is she swimming to? I thought that was just like a little puddle. Damn, you think she can get, go, go, go to the Fountain of Youth from there? No. Don't do it to him. I will not have that smile on your face as I strike you down. Take a gander, Edward Teach. Spanish people, man. Only God can grant eternal life, not this pagan water. 
destroy this profane temple. Oh, they don't even want it. They just want to destroy it. Blind. He got him with the freaking poison. For the pearl. That was the fountain, wasn't it? This one takes life. This one has a tear and gives life. Aye, hurry. Jack switched him. No. I know he switched him. He had to. Uh... Wait a minute. In fact, it, it might have been the other way around. This cup had the tear. That one had the other bit. I told you I knew it. She just seen her father's skeleton drop in front of her. Oh. Forgive me. She's dragging his ass down there. You think she's gonna kill him or save him? And how will I get free of these bonds? You broke free of your bonds half an hour ago, waiting for the precise moment to pounce. I love you. As do I. Always have. I gotta go. <laughs> Jack! He's running for that pistol. Missed! Throw oh, that infamous hat on. There we go. Now you looking like Barbosa. So it's his sword that controls it. It wasn't Blackbeard, it's his sword. Oh yeah, he just saw he was doing that with the sword. Yeah. Barbosa really just got an upgrade on his ship. <laughs> Feast your eyes. Black Pearl. Let's see the Black Pearl, baby. <laughs> she really got his doll back. Oh, what are the odds? Oh my god. <laughs> What are the odds? She got his doll back in the end. Oh my god. Okay, you know what? I'm not gonna lie. The movie itself, it wasn't awful. But it definitely wasn't better than any of the first three, in my opinion. What do you think about it? Like, I know you've I seen it before. It. But... I honestly liked it. It was pretty good. I just liked the other one. <laughs> yeah, I think that's how it is. Like, this one wasn't bad, but compared to the other ones, it's not as good as them. You know what I mean? And I think it's partly because we like the character so much and everything. Like, I wanted to see Will in this. I wanted to see Elizabeth. I wanted to see what they were doing. But it's like, this is almost like a new chapter in Pirates of the Caribbean. You know, started a completely new story. Got a bunch of new characters. I I mean, I honestly thought the, Sp the Spanish people were going to have a bigger part. They literally just showed up and destroyed the place. Which, yeah, which really did nothing because they still were able to use the Fountain of Youth. So... I don't know. I just, I feel like that whole part with them was kind of pointless. You know, I don't know if they come into play in next movie or what, but I feel like that was kind of completely pointless. Um, I did like the fact that we, we got introduced to a new character, Blackbeard. What, what do you think is better? Like the Black Pearl, Blackbeard ship, or um, the Flying Dutchman? The Black, uh, Blackbeard. Blackbeard, Blackbeard ship. <laughs> Blackbeard ship. Um, yeah, I don't know. I Because you can control it. Yeah, you control all the ropes. You can even control the wind like you did huge. and the fire and shit. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like that but was I the still best like too. But I like the Black Pearl. I like, I the, I like all of them. The Black you Pearl. Know, yeah. I, I'm pretty sure. See, each one has its own stuff. Like, because I feel like the Black Pearl is obviously the fastest out of all of them. Um, the Flying Dutchman just has an insane amount of cannons and arsenal on it. And then um, Blackbeard's ship, you can control that shit. You know what I mean? Well, maybe Blackbeard's is faster than Black Pearl if you can control the wind. You know what I mean with the sword? But I don't know. I just still like the Black, Black Pearl. Pearl. Yeah, because it's been through all the movies and then it's been came back so many times. Yeah, know? like it, it, it's the original shit, man. I like that one a lot too. And then it's gonna come back in the next one, I'm sure, because they have a little jar yeah. now. Mm -hmm. At first, I, I thought you would just have to like throw the jar in the ocean yeah, and it would I show know. up, but yeah, I guess you gotta perfect. gotta do something else. I'm excited to see the next one though. People are telling me the fifth one connects to one, two, and three. 
and I remember we we watched it, but I don't remember like part. I've seen like bits and pieces of it. Like the the main thing I remember in that is the start starting point of it, but I don't really remember the middle of the movie or the end of it at all. But so we are still gonna we're, we're gonna watch number five. Do you remember it? Yeah, you remember the whole yeah, thing. I guess we watched it recently. Well, you didn't because you fell asleep. Yeah. Well, because I, cause I hadn't seen any of the other ones, so I wasn't into it. But I am excited to watch it and understand it and fully, like, see everything because I fell asleep partway through it. I do remember the start of it, though. But regardless, guys, we are going to watch number five. Some of you guys were asking if we were watching four and five. Obviously, we just watched number four. And we are going to be watching number five as well next Monday. Um, Overall, I like the movie. It wasn't as bad as you guys said. Like, people were literally telling me, don't watch it. It's going to ruin the series for me, and I'm going to hate it. And it's like... I didn't like it as much as the first three, but it was still pretty good. I liked it. There was funny moments in it. It was dope seeing Barbosa and Jack Sparrow back working together again. But regardless, guys, let us know what you think about it in the comment section down below. Like always, did you guys think this one kind of ruined it for you? Did you still think it was good, just not up to par with the other ones? Because that's kind of how I felt. If you guys did enjoy this reaction video, make sure to leave a like. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button because we do do daily reaction videos, man. Full reaction is up on Patreon as well as early access. We hope you all have a wonderful day. And we'll see you in the next one.